What's up, everybody? Are we, are can we you, live? Can, 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 can you hear Mike, me? Come on, check one. Check, check one. What's up, guys? CH, Eddie from Homebrew for Life. Today we're making, what are we making today? We are gonna make the ultimate hangover cure. Of all time. Of all time. Yeah. Have you ever had a hangover before? Are you fucking kidding me? Uh, what do we got for ingredients? So, this is what we have for ingredients right now. We have, so we got the clamato. Clamato. Cl clamato, clamato, clamato. Same thing. Gringo, gringo. Um, we also have tahine for seasoning. A couple of other seasonings that we're gonna have right here is gonna be celery salt, cayenne pepper, and then just to give it a little hearty taste, instead of, um, a lot of people like to use soy sauce. I'm not a fan of it, but I find Worcestershire having a little bit more of a heartier taste. So if you're looking for something that has a little bit more fuller taste, you're gonna have to grab that bad boy. You heard it here first, man. Stay away from the soy sauce. Soy sauce is for fucking rookies. Are you kidding me? Rooks. The key to this is gonna be just proportions high. Just getting it right, mixing it well, and um, just making sure that you just, you know. There's a lot of myths about the Michelada. A lot of people do that styrofoam cup, that pre-made stuff. A lot of people do that Bud Light Michelada in a can. That gives Micheladas a bad reputation. Today we're gonna clean it up. We're gonna do it right. What's the first step? All right, so the first step is gonna be the most important one, which is the rim job. If you don't get the rim job right, you're gonna fuck this whole thing up. So what we have over here, we got um, tahin. You just wanna get a little plate laid out for you. You're gonna pour in the tahin so you can get the rib job right. Easy peasy, what you're gonna do is just go ahead and grab the lime. After the lime, you're just gonna squeeze that right around so the tahin's gonna hang on to it. Mm. You ever seen anything like that? You ever seen yeah. it? Ever seen a rim job just like that? There it is. There it is. Tahine, and that's it. All right, so this next step is gonna be the mix for the actual michelada. So what you're gonna do is get a full lime for this 12 ounce drink. So we're, get, we're doing proportions for a 12 ounce beer. So first thing, get the limes, the full lemon, yeah. or a lime. We're gonna squeeze that bad boy in there. The lime has the best flavor when it comes to countering with a clamato. Some people can use lemons, but it's not gonna give you the same flavor. Don't use that fake lime juice <laughs> bullshit. All right, so the next step, you're gonna get the Worcestershire sauce, and you're gonna add four to six uh, dashes of it. One, two, Three and four. Next step is gonna be the celery salt, this deliciousness. Gonna add about a couple dashes, just like that. So this next one is gonna be the cayenne pepper. Some people like it very spicy, some like mild, some like no spice, but add three to four dashes of uh, the cayenne pepper. So once you're done with all that, you're gonna shake that up, mix it very well. So what we're doing next right now, we're gonna pour 12 ounces of beer in this. Oh, that's a good shot, yeah boy. So we're gonna top it off with clamato. In this next step, we're just gonna fill out with two ounces of clamato. Mm. Say like four ounces. Four ounces. <laughs> four. We're gonna top it off a little tahini, just get add a little extra flavor to your drink. Mmm, look at that. Yeah, you like that? You like that? I do like that. So, there's no secret to Komodo. I mean, there's no secret to Micheladas. Say, say it again, now we're gonna enjoy it. All right, so now we're gonna enjoy it. Just a heads up. Micheladas, the secret is just keep it simple. Keep the portions right. I'm coming back in for the one. Let me and try it, Eddie. Go ahead and try it. I don't have a hangover anymore. I can actually go to work and be productive today. This is amazing, really good. <laughs> All right guys, thanks for watching this episode of Homebrew for Life. And that's how you make the greatest Michelada of all time. Thank you from Eddie from Oxnard. Fuck yeah. Pyro behind the camera. If you guys like this video, <laughs> click on this playlist up there. More videos of our content. If you <laughs> like this video, subscribe. If you didn't like this video, subscribe even harder. <laughs> thanks for watching guys. CH and Eddie from Homebrew for Life. Squaw. Have a good day. Squaw. That's it. See ya.